Right. Everything's experiment around here. We don't work on this crap. I got a brand new tool here. I don't know how to use it. Got some old crappy stones in here. Look at that. Looks like you're gonna sneak out of the toilet. This is the good stones. This is the good motor too. See what I did. What did I do? You scuffed it up a little bit. Any cross cross hatch in there at all? Mm. Yeah, not much. A little rust in here. Jeez, that was a good stone. I think they already loaded them up. The brand new stones are already loaded up. Mm. Now you know it's gonna help me hit this one, don't you? It's gonna rip this crap out of it. Where's my thing at? There it is, way down there. That's the repair cylinder. Mm. Yeah, this is a good one here. It's awkward. Well, don't let it win. If I hit the go trigger with my hand down here, it'll hurt. <laughs> don't let it win. Oh, shit. What did you hit down there? Uh-oh. Look down there. Just nasty down there, it looks like. It's nasty, all right. I can see it. It looks like a piece of crap down there, but it's hard. <laughs> I got the crap remover right here. <laughs> so smooth. That's flathead colonics. I'm thinking it might be a little rust. Eh, perhaps. And some other secret sauce. <laughs> Do to my stone. Break it? No, it looks okay. Yep, chipped it. Yeah, that's good. Mm -hmm. Strong. They're strong stones. It's made for me to be used. So. Look at this new fancy tool. Look at that thing. It's slick. It's hot. Beats what I had in there before. It's worth a hundred bucks. <laughs> I bought it two years ago. Give it some more tension. Not pretty smooth. I guess I have no idea what I'm doing. That's all right. I had a flashlight in there, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Let's see, if we get that out of the way, it will take me in the ass. Give me a different feel. <laughs> There's a cross hatch yet. The block's so stinking hard, the stones aren't even touching it. Crank her up. Stand like that and walk and try to go around. Jerk, 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 jerk. Mm. I guarantee it's better than it was, though. It's uh, out around. Perhaps. I would never know that. Strobe light going on? <laughs> we got the party across the street. Might as well have the strobe light in the shop. <laughs> I can't even tell what the hell it's doing, but it's doing it, whatever it is. All right. <laughs> whatever it is, it did it. Let's go to the next one. How's it look from your view? You can see it's definitely been some cross there. High spot right there. Mm. I didn't think it did anything. No. There's a little something going on there. That's still not too bad. Yep. A little flat, but better than what it was. Mm -hmm. Yep. Get 
some more. Look at that, it's getting all loaded up with crap. <clears throat> getting loaded up. All those big water marks in there, like I had. Yeah. Well, that's a nice crosshatch. I think I'm getting the speed figured out. It's like riding a bike. Most of the scratches are on this wall over here. Well, I guess I'm on the wrong side. Yes, you are. You can come over here and look at it though, if you want. Yeah, I don't think I have to go any finer than this stone because this is fine. Seems a waste of time getting the good ones out. <laughs> you want to see it from this side? Yeah. Put the light on it. Yeah. yeah. yeah so go ahead and, All right. Go ahead and mark this up some more. And then I gotta figure out what I'm doing. Kind of. A little slow. It took four holes to figure it out. As long as you use brand new stones with no oil on them, you don't have to put oil on this stuff. Yeah, that's pretty small. Pretty, pretty shiny. Yeah, that's got some torque. See it jerking? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, I got some rusty pockets in that one. Yeah, go back to the first hole. Yeah, you see all the rust in that one. Working it out. See the lines in there, all the rust. I can see them from here. Yeah. See, we're not really taking any metal out. We're just putting the finish on for the, the new rings to hit on. The new old rings. Yeah. Torque. That's why you put between your legs so you can't pull off from under you. Is that too much? No, you're good. Be strong. That might be too much torque. <laughs> at the bottom, it's way more than we need. I thought I tightened that. Did you watch me tighten it? <sighs> no, obviously it wasn't Tetra tight. No. You had that stupid, I think it's a metric. 
can't believe it's just made in Mexico or something like that. Genuine Hastings stuff, you'd think it'd be the American thread on everything. Not so much. Now the box is as old as you are. Yeah. It ain't the right size either. Yeah, it's tight. It's tight. Mainly at the top, what a shocker, that's where the crocs at. Alright, how about that look? Looks like a crop. Yeah, it's all low through here. Yeah. See, the rings aren't gonna seal very well on that side. The crack side? Yeah, just from here to here, it's just a big hole. Okay, come on from this view, you can see it. See it's all low. Oh yeah. The whole thing's low right here. Yeah, you can see that. Point the camera. It starts fogging out. Whoop, it starts fogging out right in here, but it's really low all through here. You can see the it looks like a softball. It almost looks like a ball. Yeah, it's he's called an eyebrow. Oh. So this whole thing here is pushed in. Oh. Got a cross hatch we got in there. <coughs> Crosshatch doesn't look too bad. There you go, I can see it really good right there. Yeah. Well, we're definitely not taking out much metal, so... We don't have to worry about over honing it. You'll see how they're all plugged up with crap right now. Yeah, a little dirty. So we need to unplug it. I'll pause this. 